the wall and then say every time you turn around, you to put your whole body on the altar, but it's still calling. Come on, somebody. You to put that situation on the altar, but it's still bothering you. Come on, you done prayed about it, but you still act your nerves. Come on, somebody. Thank you, Jesus. Preach, Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus leads this black man. Hallelujah. Out from the village. I don't want to lose my spot. Take your time. Thank you, Jesus. So there is a process. My God. Yes. He leads him out. And he touches his eye. Hallelujah. And he asks him a question. Yes. A lot of y'all aren't delivered because you haven't answered the question right. Yeah. Come on, somebody. Yeah. Some of y'all keep saying, I ain't there yet. That's why you ain't gonna never get there. Some of y'all say, I ain't fully delivered. And that's right, you ain't gonna be delivered. You ain't answer the question right. He asked the man, what do you see? And he says, I, 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 I can't really see. I, the Bible indicates that this man had a blurred vision. So what that means is that he was not always blind. Come on, somebody. That means he was not always blind. That means he had a sight. Come on, somebody. That means he probably was walking the way, but he fell off. He was probably walking the way, but he backslid. Come on, he was walking, but his foot slipped. Come on, he was walking, but his tongue slipped. He wasn't always blind. He knew what he was looking at. Come on, how can a blind man be able to identify a tree? He wasn't always blind. How can you sit in the house of God and you begin to speak in tongues after you had cussed all last night? You wasn't always blind. Something happened along the way. Something. Something happened. I'm going to get out the way because I look like I'm born, y'all, but I'm going to get out the way. I, that the people that I'm born ain't going through ain't going through nothing. You see, they probably married. They can lay up in the bed all night to have sex all that long. Excuse me. I'm trying to keep this PG-13. I think I'm all right. But I came to talk to a few that's been dealing with some things. God just put it in my spirit. You've been dealing and you've been tussling and you've been wrestling with some things. He said, don't deny the process. Hallelujah. I come to encourage you tonight that we have to change our confessions. Change our confessions. So he touches the man and he asks him. He leads him away. Come on, y'all remember, right? Y'all remember the process, right? First God leads you away from the crowd. Hallelujah. He does just what you asked him for. He does just what you asked him for. I tell people all the time, don't believe the enemy when he tells you you're not delivered. 